welcome to my YouTube channel. Today is Tuesday, November 5th, and today I'm going to be filming a keto what I eat in a day slash vlog because I have a ton on my agenda to do today. Right now, it's about 10 o'clock this morning. I'm about to head into the kitchen, make myself some coffee, and then I'm gonna take these guys to the dog park and let them run out some energy because I am about to leave the house for a couple of hours. I have lots of errands to run. That's what the plan is right now. Let's get today started. Look at this little guy. Ain't he cute when he's not doing bad things? It is just a sleepy morning for these pups. Bo is over here in his bed snoring. Then Cooper is sitting under my desk in the most awkward position ever. I guess just his tail gets the dog bed? I don't know. But I've been very scared I'm going to roll over him for like the past 30 minutes. Guess what time it is? It's coffee time. Pouring in some of my old bean water from a day or two ago. Hopefully it's still good. Add a little bit of that there heavy cream. Sugar-free pumpkin pie syrup. And now you use a metal straw to save the turtles. I already know y'all are going to judge me, but we have an insane amount of clothes that need to be hung up and put away. Cooper ended up peeing on our bed and we had clothes on there and I had to do the comforter and sheets and all kinds of stuff. So we just have a crap load of laundry that needs to be put away. Well, I was in the kitchen and I walked in here and found this. Someone just got all cozy in our freshly cleaned clothes. Hey guys, do y'all want the ball? You want a ball? Bo wants a ball, that's for sure. Go get it. Cooper has found himself a pine cone. Instead of running around, he just wants to chew on that. Here, want to chase this? You ready? Go get it, Cooper. Do you want me to throw the ball for you, big brain? Look at that little nub just a going. My first stop of the day is going to a tractor supply company. Well, I spent more money in there than I planned to. I'll have to do a haul whenever I get home in a little while. My next errand is running into PetSmart to spend an arm and a leg on dog food. You are looking at $80 worth of dog food. Two bags, $80. Great. Next stop is Office Max to buy overpriced printer ink. Yay! I just spent $42 on black printer ink. Good golly, that is a ripoff. I was out and about running errands for just a smidge over two hours, but I went to about a million places, so I thought I'd do a little haul, show you what I picked up while I was out and about. The first place I went was Tractor Supply, and the reason I went there is because they always have nice, like, neutral colored long sleeve shirts, and I needed a green or a tan to wear underneath my camo shirt while I'm hunting in case it's cold this weekend. So I grabbed two of these green shirts. After I grabbed those shirts, I discovered that there was a Christmas section in Tractor Supply, which is very dangerous for me right now. I ended up picking up this electric wax melt slash warmer set. It's like candles but without the wick where you just put the wax in the top and it melts it and makes the room smell good. But I thought I would have one to go in my office and then the little plug-in one, I can stick it in our bedroom so our bedroom can smell like Christmas. Since I bought the wax warmers, well, I had to buy some wax. So this is Harvest Spice and it smells just like delicious. So I bought that. And then I grabbed two ornaments. So it's this little metal chicken. If y'all didn't know, I am obsessed with chickens. I love chickens. I can't wait to have chickens again. So I had to get this cute little metal ornament. And then Cody keeps telling me he wants a revolver for Christmas. So I got him a revolver. It's probably not the kind he wants, but you know, it's, it's close enough. I thought it was cute. It'll look cute on our tree. While I was out, I also stopped by Walmart 
and I picked up some black sweatpants and a black shirt because tomorrow I'm getting my first ever spray tan. I don't know what to expect. I know nothing about spray tans, but I read online that you need black loose clothing. So I got me some black loose clothing at Walmart. And the last thing I picked up, I stopped by Burke's Outlet because I need a cute top. I didn't find anything, but I did find this little travel makeup kit. It's got two compartments. The top is for like your makeup brushes. And then there's a bottom for your makeup. And I wanted to grab this because the last time I traveled, I just threw all my makeup into like a bag. And I ended up breaking one of my compacts. So I figured maybe this would help my makeup travel a little bit safer because I am traveling a lot over the next couple months. It's the ugliest print though. It's like little kittens on cheetah print. Super ugly, but it will do the trick. Well, I think that's everything I got while I was out and about, but it is now 1.13 p.m. So I guess it's time to make some lunch because I'm hungry. I just decided that before I cook myself some lunch, I'm gonna do a quick little kitchen cleanup because it's disgusting in there. But on another note, I just got off the phone with the vet and guess who is getting neutered a week from today? This little guy is getting neutered in a week. Yay! Are you so excited? Yay! <laughs> We needed to get that done and I wanted to get it done a couple weeks before I go home for Thanksgiving so that he is nice and healed up and can run around the backyard and chase squirrels when we're at home in Baytown. So I decided that as soon as I get home next week, he's getting his neutering. Okay, all right. Remember how I cleaned the entire kitchen 24 hours ago? Yeah, that didn't last long. lunch today I'm pretty much eating the same thing I did yesterday since I had some leftovers so this is my taco salad it's got shredded lettuce ground beef some guacamole sour cream salsa and shredded Mexican cheese so just a real plain and simple meal but I love taco salad so much I just mix them all together and it's so good time to dig in it was time for me to finally tackle this giant pile of laundry that had just been stacking up. So it took me forever. If you watch this video, you can watch it go from sunny outside to dark. It took me a long stinking time. Just sorting that pile of clothes took me forever. Oh my golly. I organized it into my shirts, Cody's shirts, Cody's pants, my pants. Then over here is just like athletic wear. And y'all, I'm pretty sure this took me nearly an hour to do all of this. Just to sort it. Now I've got to put hangers in everything and hang it up. Oh my golly. It is now 5.20 p.m. and I'm going to take a break from hanging up all of the freaking laundry because I've got to figure out what we're having for dinner. Cody should be home hopefully within the next hour. He's had a long day at work. So I need to figure out if I need to run to the grocery store, what I can cook, because I just don't have any idea. I know that it bothers some of y'all how often I go to the grocery store. However, it is right down the road and it's so easy for me to go and pick up things really quickly. So for dinner tonight, I am pretty much making up a casserole on the spot. I figured I'll do some riced cauliflower. I got this rotisserie chicken. I'm gonna shred it apart. Add maybe some cream cheese, some shredded cheese. 
I don't know. We'll figure it out when I decide to make it here in just a little while. And then I got a chopped salad kit to go with it because I've been wanting this so bad. So yeah, it's going to be a simple dinner tonight and I hope my casserole turns out. Yeah. Cody is finally home from a long day at work, so I'm going to go ahead and get started on dinner. I'm making a cheesy chicken cauliflower casserole, throwing it all together, really just kind of making it up as I go, and I hope it turns out. So let's get to it. I shredded up the rotisserie chicken that I got from Winn-Dixie. And then I went ahead and cooked both of these bags of riced cauliflower. When Dixie had a sale, it was like two for five bucks. So I figured I'd cook two of them. So now I need to grab a big old bowl and we're gonna get to cooking. Where's a bowl? There's a bowl. I'm gonna preheat my oven to 400 degrees. I added my two bags of riced cauliflower into a bowl and now I'm gonna add four ounces of cream cheese. I just grated up some sharp cheddar cheese, so I'm going to add about maybe, this is I think a cup and a half or so of shredded cheese. I'm now going to add some garlic powder, some pink salt, some dried parsley, and a little black pepper. Now I'm just going to stir this up until the cheese is all mixed into the cauliflower. And now I'm going to add in my shredded chicken. Now I'm going to add some bacon bits into here. Now that everything's all mixed up, I am going to dump it into a baking dish and just flatten it out. And the final step, I'm just going to add a little bit more cheese over the top. I'm going to put this cauliflower chicken cheesy casserole in the oven. I'm going to start it at 20 minutes at 400 degrees. I ended up leaving this cauliflower casserole in the oven for about 25 minutes at 400 degrees. And I think it cooked perfectly. I'm letting it cool off for a minute and then we're gonna serve ourselves the serving and hopefully it turned out delicious. I haven't tried it yet, but Cody gave me two thumbs up on the recipe, which is good to hear. And then I just have my little chipotle salad, whatever it's called. So that is dinner, about to dig in. Hey guys, it is the next morning. I flat out forgot to film an outro last night. So I went and took a shower and I had to exfoliate and shave because I'm getting my first spray tan today. And y'all, shaving my legs is like an Olympic sport. It takes me forever. I got a lot of leg here, y'all. I got a lot of leg. So <laughs> I did that and after I was done, I just was ready for bed. So forgot to film the outro. So it is what it is. It's the next morning. I look scary, but I hope that you enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below if you haven't done so. And I will see y'all very soon with another video. Bye guys! Mm-hmm.